all right guys welcome back to the channel so this is going to be the part two of my part one video with the uh, DJI Mavic Air 2 with the new master or screw propellers that I just installed in my previous video so this is going to be the maiden voyage flight so we already got everything set up guys let me go ahead and switch cameras so you guys can see the drone is set take off actually you know what let's go ahead and take it off and then I'll show you the other view. So we got about 11 satellites, guys. Everything's good. So let's go ahead and do an auto takeoff on the app. There we go, guys. So there you go, guys. Sorry about the sensors. So very quiet, guys. Not too loud. Very low pitch. Let me get out of the way so I can stop beeping. Alright. There you have it guys. Alrighty guys, so let's go ahead and do a quick takeoff. I am still recording. Pick it up about Camera down. Just gonna take it up a little bit, about 30 feet, guys. Alrighty, guys. So it is a very low pitch. Camera up. Alright. So let's see what these bad boys can do. Get that rule of thirds, guys. And here we go. First maiden flight, guys, with the Havoc Air 2 stealth propellers. Getting some altitude right here, guys. About 250 feet should be good. Pretty gloomy day today, so. Not the best day to fly. Obviously, there is little to no wind, which is a good thing because we are going to be testing out that speed. That they claim to say that it's about 2 miles per hour more. So, we'll see how that does. Alright. So, let's go ahead and uh, stop right there. Should be good enough right there. Let's go ahead and turn it around, guys. Nice little slow, y'all. Alrighty. So, how about we put it in that support mode and see where we can get up to, guys. Alrighty. Full stick forward now. Thirty-seven. Forty. Forty-one. Forty-two. Yeah, about 42 guys. I mean, I don't know what the original is, but um, tell you what, let's go around the other way and see what we can get. Let's go around this way over here. We're getting about 38 guys, about 38 miles per hour, so let's go ahead and uh, 39, go ahead and turn it around again, 
Probably a little bit of wind going that way. Alright. Let's head back this way. See what we can get. Forty-two. Forty-one. Forty-two. Forty-two and a half, I seen About 42 miles, I mean, guys, you know, it's uh, fairly similar to the stock. It's a little bit quieter, that's for sure. Alright, we're gonna stop it right there, guys. Let's go ahead and bring it up now to a little bit. Get that signal boost. Let's go ahead and turn it around. Sorry about that, quick, y'all, guys. Right, so let's go ahead and bring it back. So there is a slight wind coming back, going the other way. So yeah, I think those two mile per hour things are, I'd say maybe a mile per hour more. So, go around this way. Forty, forty-two. Alright, so yeah, there you have it guys, the speed right there. Let's go ahead and put it back into normal mode. Alright, so what else can we test out? So the flight time, I mean, should be probably similar. Nothing too different than the original. school right here guys obviously there's no school check it down the altitude a little bit <clears throat> Obviously, the only point. So, here we go. Full stick forward. Can we get 42? 42, yes, 42. 42 miles per hour. Turn it back around, guys. We want to go into the street. And here we go again. So yeah guys, I guess the top speed on this one would be 42 miles per hour with the uh, Master Air Scoop Pops. I don't see any slight difference, you know, I guess I'll go ahead and bank it to the left, sorry. Make it 
to the right. Let's go up a little bit, guys. Yeah, about 8.9. Take it down. Forty two, forty two point two. Yeah, guys, I mean, pretty much, I'd say probably about one mile per hour difference with the new props. Obviously, they do look better. There is a quieter tone. Mm -hmm. That's why backwards. We get about forty one. I do have the bird right above me, and honestly, we're about 280 feet in the air. Let's go ahead and bring it down, maybe I'll say about 250. And, yeah, you can't hear it, guys. They're quiet. I mean, obviously, when you push the throttle, then, yeah, you can probably obviously hear it. So let's go full stick forward, see if we hear anything. Quiet guys, not too loud. All right, it should be good right there. Cause obviously, these houses are blocking my view. So there you have it guys, how about we go ahead and do a, let's go ahead and put it back into a normal mode. And let's do a return at home, see how that uh, precision landing works, huh? Go home. So there you have it guys. The Mavic Air 2 with the DJI uh, Master Air Screw propellers self propellers alright and I can see the bird coming home alrighty I'm gonna go ahead and take out my other camera so you guys can see that landing. Right. And there we are, guys. And I will pause it, obviously. Landing. So it is orienting itself, turning around. I say it's right on the dot. So let's go ahead and check that out. how close it gets to that uh, landing pad. And there it comes, guys. I say it's pretty far on. 
And there she is, guys. Pretty spot on, guys. On the money, guys. So there you have it guys, the precision landing with the master air screw propellers on the Mavic Air 2. Uh, spot on as you guys seen in the video. So quick conclusion guys, you know, uh, our speed we topped out at about 42.5 miles per hour. So I say about one mile per hour more than the original props. As far as the sound goes, you know, it is a lower pitch sound. You know, obviously you guys will be able to hear that when you hear it in person. Uh, other than that, you know, it just gives it a better aesthetic look, you know, different colors you could choose from. So, I mean, I'd say it's a really good upgrade from the original props. So, yeah, that's about it, guys. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.